hey, I haven't used Gran Turismo wheel for so long. But since we got Forza on a PC, I wonder, will it work? A PlayStation 3 wheel with the Forza. Well, let's see. I have installed Logitech drivers, and this is a great start. Wheel is recognized. Let's open options and see what we have in the controller tab. I saw this wheel in the official Forza support list. So let's see if there is a preset for that Rise Force uh, Gran Turismo wheel. Perfect. Oops. <laughs> so there is an official. So here is the official preset. I just need to save it with the keyboard. For some reason, menu shortcuts are still accessible only with the keyboard. But whatever. The important part is the race support. selected the official preset. Not all buttons are working. I can shift with paddles, but not the shift and up, which is strange. But I have binded all extra buttons myself, so let's try it again. This is more like it. I like the feel, and it actually might be playable pretty much with the default settings, which is nice. I don't think Forza Horizon or Apex had any proper third-party wheel support at least a year ago and on a PC. I like force feedback a lot, but the turn radius could be bigger, so let's put uh, 480 degrees in settings and it will be just slightly over 180 degrees to one side, like that. Let's try a different car too. Let's check new deals for today. Great, M6 it will be. Well, it works surprisingly really well, and I used the only stock preset, just added extra button bindings, and put sensitivity down to 10% to increase uh, deal tune radius. I have played Forza with a gamepad for a few hours already. It is fun, but with a wheel, it's a completely different experience. A way better immersion and it's even easier to precisely control speed and turn angle. Plus I can exactly feel the road like in a real car. It's not just a vibration on a gamepad, but the whole wheel gets pulled if you drive off the road or get bumped by a other car. Okay, it's Forza. I get constant restarts so far with this game. So let's start it again and let's try the last card for this video. What should I take? Straight up 
gangster, yo, we keeping it real. Do whatever we feel, yo, we rob and steal. And the 190 class is a pimp mobile. Took your girl to the drive and gave her happy meal. Straight from the start, there is a noticeable force field difference driving Mercedes after the Beamer. Stronger, heavier, just like a tank. Totally brings memories of my C220 from the 90s. To sum up, I am really impressed with the game so far. It's like a need for speed from a long time ago, like the original Hot Pursuit, just way better graphics, way better handling, and wheel support is on a, another level. I have played this game maybe for 6 hours now, and it was fun all the time. It might be just the best racing game for the PC right now. And yes, crashes are annoying, and Microsoft is full of shit with Windows Store and all DLC microtransaction business. But let's leave that aside, and the game itself, it might be just the best Forza, especially as a first PC racing series. And more important, we finally have non-Microsoft wheel support for our Forza game. Thanks for watching, thumbs up if you liked the video. And see you next time. And on the street they be like, what's that stank? Baby, don't you know I keep that grease in the tank? And I got it from the kebab store down on the corner. So when I drive past you, I own ya. So I'm driving around in my 190 class. And since I bought this car, I never had so much ass.